Hello, Julia. Thank you, teacher. Hello, Julia. How are you? Oh, fine. Thank you. Hey, I didn't check what you said me a moment ago, but I'll do it later. After okay, class. don't worry. Don't worry. Take your time. Thank okay. you. Oscar, how are you? Good night. I'm good good evening. Well. Hey, are I'm you okay. in your house or are you at work? No, I'm at home. At home. At home. Okay, good. Yeah. You're in the darkness. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're right. Okay, I good. I hear a, a lamp, uh, I mean a desk lamp. Okay, good, yeah. good. When do you go back to work? Uh, maybe next week. Okay. So they they notify you when you have to be present? Uh-huh, we have a schedule. Um, and if I'm not uh, at my workplace, my co-workers uh, send me a WhatsApp with the okay. schedule image. Okay, good, uh -huh. good, good, good. All right, so you go for 24 hours. Um, by now, yeah, by now, uh, due to this, this pandemic times, uh, we are taking 24 hour shifts, but um, they are, or 48, but uh, how to say, uh, in normal, I mean, Currently, we we have a eight hours shift okay. per day, per day, right. and we we have to complete uh, forty four hours All right. per week according to the Código de Trabajo. All right, good, good. Vilma, how are you? I'm fine. How was I'm... your day? It was really good. Nice, nice. Ellie, you're back. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening. Yes. Were you on vacation? Oh, uh, no, teacher. I have a lot of work. Okay. All right. Okay, so welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So what's today's date, class? September 30th. 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 Yes, you have to use uh, ordinal numbers. So you say September oh, yeah. 30th. So if today 30th. is the 30th, what is tomorrow? 31st. Uh, first. 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 Yes. October the 1st. October 1st, exactly. And what's the celebration? Uh, children's, children's Day. Children's Day. Okay, children's yeah, Day. Children's Day. Do you do you remember when you were a little kid how you celebrated? Mm. Yeah. Mm. yeah. We used to have a piñata. Right. With the yeah. neighbors. With the right. neighbors. Uh, and right. also, what else? Some snacks. Uh -huh. Right. Or sometimes uh, schools, they will make excursions and they will take you to any place. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah. tomorrow, that's not going to be possible because of the emergency we're going through. So anyways. All right. Uh, let's talk about yesterday. Um, do you remember the topics we covered? Uh, about the yarn and yeah. Okay. Yarn and the present no, perfect I, continuous. Yeah, the, the, the present perfect continuous. Present. Right, right. Uh -huh. and, and, and what is the function of the present perfect continuous? It's to, mm -hmm. to express that the studied in the past, but it's still continuous now. Right, something that starts in the past but still continues uh, up to now. The action is in progress. Very good. So, uh, what is the form of the main verb? Have has plus been plus past. We use plus, the verb uh, ing. Okay. Ing. 
So you say, I have been teaching for six days. I have been teaching for six days. Okay. So the form of the main verb is ing. Yes. Okay. Um, anything else about yesterday? Any questions or comments? No. Okay. So let's go to our first activity. Um, let me ask you, how do you keep informed about the events in El Salvador and all the world? Do you read the newspaper? Do you listen to the radio? Do you watch the news? What do you do? In my case, I don't like to read uh, local uh, newspapers like, well, you know them. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I prefer to check, um, there is a portal uh, called Infovae, that is uh, worldwide information. And I think it's, uh, they don't have like uh, politic preference. So that's why I check that, that, that portal, uh, that, that portal Infovae. All right, good. Yeah, you mentioned something very important that uh, the media shouldn't have any political preferences. They should be like between, between, but anyways. Okay, mm -hmm. someone else, uh, read the newspaper, watch the news, listen to the radio. I watch the local news. Okay. Once per day. Um, and also I watch international uh, news uh, on maybe CNN or BBC. Okay. Once, once a day. Okay, so what are the main forms of, of for Salvadorians to stay informed? What, what do we do to be informed? Take Facebook. Okay, Facebook. Yeah, social media. No social media. No. Okay, local <laughs> newspapers, radio station, TV channels. So there are different options. Okay. So, uh, do you remember the meaning of the word news? Do you do you remember uh, the meaning of the word acronyms? Acronym. Do you see the chat? Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. What is an acronym? It's when you form a word from uh, mm -hmm. sentences in vertical. Okay. You take the first letter of each, of each sentence and then you have a word. Something okay. Like I don't know how to speak. I don't okay. know how to it in English. All right. But in Spanish, I have it a little clear. Okay. Okay. Let me give you examples of acronyms. CAES, ANDA, IS, oh. PNC. Mm -hmm. Those are examples of acronyms. Right. Okay. So uh, an acronym is a word that we use where every letter represents something. And news is an example of an acronym. What's the meaning of news? Well, I don't know. No. Okay. When you read the newspaper, is the information only local or does it come from different parts of the world? Different. Okay, so let me give you a tip. The first letter <laughs> means north. North. Yeah. So east, what does south? North, yeah. east, west, south. Uh -huh. Exactly. North, wow. east, west, and south. Uh -huh. So that's, that's the meaning of the word news. So today we're going to be talking about news. Let me show you this. Uh -huh. And we go with the vocabulary section. Okay, do you see the vocabulary? Epidemic. Uh -huh. yeah. Epidemic. What Famine. else? Famine. Famine. What about Hijacking. the other one? Hijacking? Hijacking? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Kidnapping. Kidnapping. Natural disaster. Yes, natural disaster. Political crisis. 
crisis. Political crisis, that is correct. Rebellion. Yes, rebellion. Recession. Uh, recession, yes. Robbery. 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 And Scandal. what's the last one? Scandal. 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 Okay. Any questions about that vocabulary? Mm -hmm. What is the meaning one. to hijacking? Okay. Does anybody know the meaning of hijacking? Mm -hmm. Hijacking is when you steal, not steal, when you rob somebody's car. Let me okay, hijack. So you have carjack and you have hijack. A carjack is when you steal someone's car. Hijack is when you steal someone's uh, airplane. airplane. Mm -hmm. yes. So do you remember the attacks of September 11th? Yes. Uh -huh. So how did the terrorists uh, carry the attack? First, they hijacked uh the airplane okay um any other questions about this vocabulary kidnapping 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 okay kidnapping is when you take somebody's freedom by force sequestro kidnapping yes child child which one that's when they kidnapping shy. Not kidnapping. Kidnapping is sequestered when you take somebody's freedom. Okay, so let me assign you to work in pairs so you guys start discussing the meaning of this vocabulary. Here we go. Everybody received the image in the WhatsApp chat, so time is to uh, discuss the meaning of each word. pero en otro. And do you know about the robbery meaning? No. Robbery, I think, is robar, but I... I'm looking on translate. What is the word? Ah, robbery. Robbery is uh, taking property unlawfully. Yeah, take somebody's property. Yes. Okay. Did you took the Did you take the picture about the vocabulary? Can you share your screen photo because I don't have it? Me too, I'm sorry, but... Oh, you don't have I it? Okay, just... let, let me share it right now. Okay. Can you see it? Thank you. Yes. All right. Did you take the screenshot? Okay, I took it. All right. Yes? I think it's good now. Uh, one more time, please. Into it now, but uh, we were talking about the topic. Uh, you're discussing the meaning, the definition of each word. Ah, okay. Yes. Thank you. All right, good. Okay, and, and the fifth one, ep ep epidemic. 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 For me, So what was the other word? Um, what else? Hmm? 
Teacher, you were saying mm -hmm. that if we receive a, a mail or something like that? No, uh, I sent this image to the WhatsApp chat. Okay. Uh -huh. Did you receive it? No. Uh, are you are you in the chat? No, I haven't uh, registered in the chat. I mean, oh, I haven't... okay. What about you, mm -hmm. Vilma? No, I'm not registering your chat. On the okay, chat. hold on. Let me uh, give me a second so I can. Okay, can you see the screen right now? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. so you want to mm -hmm. take yeah take a picture or a screenshot? I'm taking it now. I'm taking a picture. Okay, okay I, I got it now. Okay. So we have to talk about any, okay. any the, 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 exactly simple the meaning of each word. Okay. Good. Yes. Um, for example, another epidemic. Um, uh, el del zancudo, ¿cuál es? Dengue. The chicken wound? Chicken wound, yes. Yes. Okay, the second one. Ah. Famine. Uh, um, the. Um, um, agriculture. I don't know how to say that. Agriculture. Uh, agriculture, okay. They get down. And so yeah. that's that is um a big problem for us. Yeah. In the future yes. it can it can cause famine. Yes, it's true. <clears throat> uh a jacking is the is like a is the airplane say say right. say the teacher right with many members who has many yeah many less, members losses uh, all the lost the, all the house and, and and their lives in 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 that storm. Yes. Losses they proper their properties, uh, even uh, members of members of their families. Yes. Kids, mm -hmm. uh, parents, parents, hus uh, housewives, husbands. Yes. Even pets, uh -huh. dogs, cats. I don't know. Really, it was very tough uh, to 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 watch that kind of videos. Yes. Um. Well, about, uh, we are going to have a recession after this pandemic, right? We already have the recession. The recession is already here. <laughs> okay, <laughs> yes. I yeah, think. the recession is already here with, with us. Believe me, I try to, I, uh, I try to feel, uh, to feel in thankful for, to have a job. And yeah. I tried with all my heart to to avoid to spend money in, in things that I don't need. Right. 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 Yeah. <laughs> we have to. Believe me, it's a fight of bread every day because if I go to the mall, for example, and I see something that I like, yeah, it's like mm, I like it, I like <laughs> it, I want it, but I try to yes. avoid to 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 buy. Yes, it. only the Indeed. necessary. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. exactly because mm. because I don't mm. know what is going what what is going to happen. Then I don't know. We, mm -hmm. we let's carry. It. True. For example, I I don't have a, a girl who who has helping me in the in the house chores in my house, and I am thinking. <laughs> I, I don't want to have it again because because it's, it's an, another expense expense so I have a hard time <laughs> right I mean, but, have you been working from home or uh, yes yes oh, I'm working yeah. from home yes 
Working yeah, from we, home. Had a, we had a working at home. Okay. And and well, my husband and my son is not good in house chores. <laughs> they are not good in house chores. Okay. So so I have to do it almost everything. But well, it's it's a uh that's the the things that happen in this okay and before the emergency did you have a worker in your house Rosie? yes yes mm -hmm. okay yes i always but I is, one is, one. I, uh, one. stay at home it's an advantage because you have to you can you can stay here to to do uh, everything and you don't have to to travel to to the work. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, mine. She's going. In, uh, many, a lot of people. Oh, really? In uh, cities. Yeah. Uh, many years ago, existed kidnapping in San Miguel, too. And in my family, uh, around, let me see, maybe 10 years ago, uh, kidnapping the, the, the brother to my sister-in-law. Really? Yeah. yeah. And did the family uh, pay? Did they pay? Not, not really. When, when they, uh, when the police uh, investigate the case, um, uh, they don't pay. But when found the the, the brother to my sister in law, uh, he. He was a uh, murder. Really? Yeah. Okay. A sad ending. And is, yeah. Yeah. And, and many years ago, I remember read about the kidnapping in San Miguel City. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, to shies. To children. Ah, uh, yeah. Children. Okay. All right. Yeah. All in right. San Miguel City. In, in San Salvador, too. Ah, and I remember when I was, uh, I had work, working, I had been working in other company, kidnapping the um, nephews, uh, if you co worker. Really? Yeah, and they don't appear. They really? dis disappear. Yeah. And they never found them. No. That's a, that's, a, that's a sad story too. Yeah. All right, let's go back to the main session. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. All right, all right. Any questions or comments about the vocabulary you guys were discussing? No, is everything clear? I guess so. <laughs> yes. You're, you know, there, there is a famous expression in English that says that your silence is deafening. So mm. when you don't, when you don't say anything, you're saying a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's uh, let's continue with uh, today's agenda. Uh, the following conversation is related to uh, it's connected to the previous one. Okay. Can you see the questions? Yes. Okay. Volunteer to read number one. Uh huh. Me, teacher. Yes, please. How closely do you follow the news? 
what kind of his or history no of stories, stories interesting you okay good very good thank you jennifer carolina what do you think was the most important new history in the last few years very good nice and number three another volunteer do you think uh, stories about sports and celebrities count as real news? Okay, so so those are the three questions you guys will discuss right now. Let me recreate um, okay. the your partners. So you speak with someone different. Uh, break our rooms, recreate recreate and we're gonna move this person to number seven and this person will go to room five all right let's do this Say me, don't, don't, you didn't see any news because I have a problem with the... The questions or no? Yes. I'm going uh, to read. read. Yes. Okay. Okay, how, how closely do you follow the news? I watch uh, the news. Uh, just to be, just enough to be informed. Ah, you know, yeah, yeah. It's in, important. Uh -huh. yeah. The local news is, is useful. It's useful. The local news are, are useful. And the international news, for me, mm -hmm. are good to practice or and to listen English. Ah, and yeah, also to know to, to get updated in the international. The, all, ta all kind of the, the news there, there, there are. What is the question? <clears throat> what kind of, of the story or, or, or news there is in, in the TV or magazine? Mm -hmm. For example, sport, fashion, and I don't know. Good. Well, yeah. Like, mm -hmm. Political? Okay. Pandemia, but <laughs> but now I I don't I, I don't do, I don't follow the news. Do you right remember now. each Sunday? No, not each Sunday, but when uh, suddenly a person the new over. Today we have a cadena nacional. Ah. ah. <laughs> Again. <laughs> <laughs> Almost each each weekend, <laughs> but uh, well, Almost after. Every